Welcome to our latest video. I'm Ryan Chan, the CEO and founder of Upkeep, and today we're going to explore the critical role of reliability principles in shaping the future of power generation. Specifically, we're going to discuss the resurgence of nuclear power and why it's becoming a viable option for energy independence. We'll also consider the ways in which our understanding and approach to nuclear power need to shift, much like the insights from organizational psychologist Adam Grant's book, Think Again. With the world's power landscape in flux, it's time to reconsider our options. Let's dive in. Did you know that the first nuclear power reactor in 30 years came online last week? This was made possible by the application of reliability principles. These tools are designed to help us balance risk, cost, criticality, and the benefits of maintenance activities on our key assets. And we believe they can also be applied by our policymakers when making future decisions about nuclear power. I've been reading a book by Adam Grant, an organizational psychologist, called Think Again. This book encourages readers to let go of knowledge and opinions that no longer serve them well, and to anchor their sense of self in flexibility rather than consistency. It's made me reconsider our society's age-old position on nuclear power. Until the middle of the 19th century, the majority of the world burned things like wood or crop waste to generate energy. Then came the Industrial Revolution, introducing coal, which generated half the world's energy by the turn of the 20th century. Three decades ago, the vast majority of our world's power was still generated by coal, oil, natural gas, and traditional biomass. In recent years, alternative power sources like nuclear, solar, wind, and hydropower have come into the picture. Unfortunately, when most people think about nuclear power, they remember the rare but catastrophic accidents such as Fukushima, Chernobyl, and Three Mile Island. However, current world events are shifting the risk-reward balance. We have an ever-increasing concern about global warming and the impact of carbon emissions on the long-term viability of our planet. Geopolitical conflict between Ukraine and Russia has significantly affected energy and fuel prices throughout Europe, raising concerns about energy independence in the United States. And at the same time, the design of nuclear reactors have improved significantly, boosting the safety and viability of nuclear power generation. Nuclear power offers an alternative to greenhouse gas producing energy. With the Ukraine-Russia war impacting energy prices and pushing many countries into an energy crisis, the United States has worked hard to achieve energy independence as a means of national security and continued prosperity. The addition of nuclear power may help us achieve and maintain that goal. The design of nuclear reactors have improved significantly, making nuclear power one of the safest methods of generating power. Modern nuclear reactors are near impossible to melt down as they did in past catastrophes, even if these reactors are struck by an earthquake or other natural disasters. This brings us to the point that reliability engineering is all about balancing risk and reward. It's extremely difficult to evaluate true risk when occurrences are very rare but potentially devastating as nuclear catastrophes have been in the past. Balancing risks, understanding criticality, and assessing potential investments in asset maintenance are the daily tasks of reliability engineers. They often work to understand failure rates of individual asset components to predict reliability as part of a criticality assessment process. Many use failure mode and effects analysis, or FMEA, tools to identify potential problems and their overall impact on the operation of a piece of equipment or even on an entire production line. So, as we move forward, policymakers should rely on these reliability principles and work closely with those intimately involved in nuclear power generation to evaluate the risk and reward equation, especially in light of the ongoing challenges in global warming and geopolitical conflicts that we are experiencing today. It's time to reevaluate the risks and rewards of building additional nuclear reactors in this country. And that concludes our video for today. Thank you for taking the time to join us. We've explored the critical role of reliability principles in power generation, the resurgence of nuclear power, and the potential it holds for energy independence. If you found this information valuable, don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more insightful content. To learn more about how Upkeep can help your maintenance and operations teams, visit our website at upkeep.com. We look forward to seeing you in our next video.